Who's this fine figure of cyclist? Oh my goodness, it's Alan. Oh, hello. After the best part of a week riding the Pennine Brideway, I arrived in Penrith and Alan met me with the intention of filming a coherent video documenting a well-planned loop somewhere in the Lake District. What happened in the end was that we just set off following a path we thought looked like fun. And it was nice to just pedal and chat and not worry overly much about filming every little detail of the route. How is it, Jeffers? I can't feel my feet anymore. On top of this, it turned out to be a really hard route. You know, coming at the end of a week of rides that I describe as being really hard. This was bike up on the shoulders, clambering over jagged rocks hard. We both fell off more than once. By the end of it, really, we were just concentrating on uh, trying to get home with a bit of light in the sky and the chip shop open. Neither of which we achieved. I think we were out for 10 hours or more in the end. It was all rather unexpected. So I'm narrating this intro after the fact, just to forewarn you, this one might be a little bit patchy. There'll be some nice views. It is what it is. And what it is, is mine and Alan's loop on the south bank of Ullswater in the Lake District. <laughs> Twenty twenty one Lake District Hill Climb competitor number one Alan Lon Hokey is going for it. On the marks a three, a two, a one, go. That is not the attitude. He's an animal. I'm not beating that. It's a valiant attempt. For those of you who don't know, what Alan really likes to do is drive long distances and then cycle up massive hills. So we've ticked both of those boxes. Well, yeah. How far did you drive? <coughs> Six hours, 20 minutes. And how far have we just climbed? <laughs> Not very far. We've been climbing for hours. We're probably gonna die up here. We've done about a third of our loop and it's 2.30 and we've eaten all our food. I think I saw a wolf over there or maybe a bear. Happy days. It's amazing. Go over there. <laughs> Devers! Devers! So we've climbed up to the trig point at the top of Load Pot Hill, just outside Penrith. 669 metres above something, sea level I assume. It's very, very beautiful. There's a big rain cloud over there, but we think it's going in the other direction. It said that in three minutes and it was messing with it. Two million feet. We've been arguing units. I don't understand yards, so. From here, 
We've used up most of the day and we're about a third of the way into our ride that we had planned. So we're gonna to have to work out our way down to the lake and then back along the shores of the lake. It might be quite a gnarly descent, but we'll try and fill some of it. Saying? I was saying the lady of the lake offered forth the sword Excalibur into the hand of he, the true king of England, who would arise in our hour of need to save us from something terrible. Where's my sword? Alan have bitten off more than we can chew. We're up a mountain, it's very, very rocky. Alan's already gone over the handlebars. We're about 15 miles from home and about 800 meters up. And we've got a long way to go and it's getting dark and it was snowing a bit just now. If we don't survive this, part of the adventure, part of the adventure is me breaking an ankle and Alan eating me getting inside me like a torn torn to keep warm at night. Anyway, we're not really gonna die. We're going that way. Onwards. made it to the bottom to some very very gnarly hiker bike carry the bike i carried my bike a little bit yeah there's a lot of bike carrying going on i fell over twice my feet really hurt but we got back to the lake we're at lake level and it's very very beautiful the last of the summer sun is coming in summer sun evening sun I'm really tired and I need some fish and chips. We've got about 10 miles, I think, back to Penrith. It's gonna be dark by the time we get back and I'm gonna be hungry as a hunter, so. Have you had a nice ride, Alan? It's been awesome, yeah, it's been really nice. Good. Full of uh, surprises. Gonna go for a swim now, aren't you? Yeah, yes. But we're not gonna film the swim because that just wouldn't be fun. Bye now. <laughs> so that's that. Mine and Alan's loop of the lakes. What a stunner. Really hard, but well worth it. One that will live on in memory for a good long while. Although, as I film this little outro, I've been back at work and back in real life for a month, I think. It's enough to take the edge off it. It's made me start thinking about the next one. I'm not sure what the rest of this summer has in store for me exactly, but I'm sure there'll be a few rides and a few videos off the back of them. So if you want to be involved in that, like, comment, hit the subscribe button, and uh, we'll see what happens. If you haven't already, check out my Pennine Brideaway videos. There'll be a link in the description to a nice playlist of those so you can binge them at your leisure. And now though, I've got to get pedalling because it's dark and I fear the badgers may be massing in the fields. So I'm going to get on my way. Stay safe, stay groovy. I'll see you all on the next one. <laughs>